Soul family, my name is Meghma Hira and I am an Ego Alchemy Coach. I help people who are going through their spiritual awakening to navigate their transformation and leverage it to transform themselves into their most authentic and sovereign version. Today I want to share a story with you, a story, a personal story about divine alignment and divine support. What I want to express through this narrative is when you take one step towards yourself, toward your soul's true essence and follow your intuition's guidance to take one tiny step to listen to that you know calls and desires of your heart the divine comes in with tenfold support and when you just with that action of doing the tiny thing for yourself you open a portal and give your spirit teams and the universe permission to sweep right in and help you and help you to be in alignment with your soul help you to you know follow your soul's purpose because you failed that you were in misalignment and you did the tiniest bit of thing the only thing that you thought that you could do in order to get a little bit in alignment with your true signature, with your true energetic blueprint, everything shifts after that. Everything. Around nine months ago, I was scrolling through Instagram and I came across an ad of a writer's community. Okay, and I was working my day job as a software developer in a startup and for quite some time, like even before I saw that ad, uh, like year or two preceding that, I have been thinking to get back to art, to get back to writing, you know, these dreams and little desires I had as a child, but I literally brushed it away because as many of us, I kind of learned and, you know, imprinted the idea upon myself that these fantasies of, you know, being a writer, publishing a book someday, are to be entertained once you have a good job, have a stable family life and basically tick marked all the milestones and check boxes that society provides you, then you can go and follow whatever childish dreams you have. So, anyways, I was feeling kind of disconnected with myself for quite some time and I realized that I need to get back to my creative side tap into it anyhow doesn't have to become a big thing but i need to have some structure some motivation you know some nudge that pushes me to you know write an article and make a drawing stuff like that just somebody to do it with to find a community of people who are writing who are making paintings so anyway all these things were going on in my head for some time and I tried to you know do these things alone but with all the negativity of life and the pressure of work and not even feeling like myself it was very difficult. So I saw this ad and I the ad said uh, basically I clicked on it I went to the link and I skimmed through it and the, it was about like how if you become a part of their community which had a very small fee very nominal fee that you have to pay so that they can allow access to their internal group on an app and so that you can after that you can talk to them you know share your experiences learn and exchange on all that so basically you pay a small fee and you get to be a part of a community and they organize this monthly writing contest and uh, 
I saw, yeah, there were like around 400, 500 people in that community. Uh, I saw enough pictures and posts to know that, yes, this is a legit thing and these are people who are, you know, doing something, you know, encourage writing and uh, they appear to be a nice group of people and my intuition said like, hey, this is affordable, this is something will help you, you know, you just participate in the writing contest, it would be fun, like school time, you used to enjoy that. I signed up for this uh, program just to participate in that monthly writing contest and have an excuse or reason to write, to try writing something, to put my thoughts into a coherent piece of passage. And I didn't know anything else about this community. To me, they were just a group of writers who encourage other writers and have this monthly thing and they meet on Zoom and talk about it, you know, discuss grammar and sentences and new words and stuff like that. I liked it, I joined. Few days into this program and I'm attending this uh, sort of sessions that uh, the community manager, the CEO of this whole community and academy, Mr. Rajinder uh, used to give and I learned that actually this community was not just about being a writer in your free time and you know writing for contests and gaining some money. This community was actually helping people to get into their core purpose get into their what they want to do in life what they were here to do in life how they can leverage all the experiences and skills they have accumulated so far no matter if you're 17 30 or 70 you are welcome and you are welcomed and encouraged to start over again and i love that energy and i used to just go there and sit in the sessions for the you know that feel of community that feel of people supporting each other and that felt amazing and from there if you haven't guessed already from there the journey of ego alchemist began there when megma hira realized that I have this whole new other thing to explore and my life has been building up to this point to explore myself and to expand myself and share all my knowledge, wisdom, skills and all the stories and my vibes through Ego Alchemist. Become a spiritual coach, an Ego Alchemy coach help people through their ascension because when I went through the ascension I did not uh, even I tried I connected with people but maybe the universe no meant it to be that way that I did not really get to connect with people um, who have already gone through this luckily for the internet and Instagram I could see people from a distance through their posts and whatever they're sharing on video and writings and audios but to really connect to be a part of a group and we get personal get really vulnerable and i realized this is what i wanted to do my soul was calling and it is a sense of excitement and happiness and how do you know that you are in soul alignment because you feel happy and it doesn't it get hard it gets so hard you know sometimes and you are still human you awaken spiritually you ascend you realize that you are divine but you have been living in a powerless state for all these years and that doesn't go away in one day or even a year or two it takes time and a lot of work and consistency but when you are in alignment with your soul, when the divine has supported you and answered to your tiny action, inspired action to just want to write something, anything, just part of being a part of a competition, when all the support comes and places you in your soul's true path, in your soul's journey, and you're in alignment of your soul's mission, it feels incredible and no matter how hard and difficult and challenging it can get, you can always take a step ahead or take a 
step further. I wanted to share this story with you today so that it may and I hope that it inspires you to follow through when you have an inspired instinct to just go and try something to go and connect back to the things that you did as a child that you dreamt of as a child and see the magic of the universe that when you take one step for yourself when you love yourself like that because nobody else was getting affected around me whether i wrote something an article a story or a blog nobody else was getting affected by it but me and i am sure people who are watching this have experienced or experiencing similar thing and that's why i am today inspired to make this video and share it with you my only intention and dreams and hopes behind sharing this story with you is like you take that action when your spirit tells you to when you feel an urge to go back to your soul go back to yourself come home to yourself do that and you'll see the magic of the universe if you like this story and this helped you in any way or resonated with you please like this video share or subscribe to my channel you can also follow me on instagram where i am a little more active and i post daily i i post affirmations and uh, general ideas and epiphanies about spirituality and spiritual ascension this is what i do i help people who are going through this process this process is divine is necessary is beautiful and it really transform us into something great and incredible but this process can be tough especially in the beginning especially when you're just introduced into this whole new reality where you are the creator and you have been the creator always also i would love to hear your thoughts so drop them in the comments and uh, if you have any questions or anything you would like uh, me to talk about i am happy 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 to serve you thank you and have a great day have a great week a year a great life i love you and thank you for being here and watching this i just wanted to get back in touch with my creative side <coughs> <coughs>